Hi, uh, my name is Gabriella Moriarty. I'm the curator for this show. This Matters, Mind and Seen Heart, A Journey to Wholeness. The this in This Matters is mental health, expression, art, poetry, storytelling, all these things matters towards our own well-being. And Mind Unseen Heart is a play on words, our mind and our heart, because one of the things I find is challenging towards people that identify with mental health issues is the fact that it's invisible. They may not even be aware of it themselves. It's not like a cut or a wound uh, that you can see, obviously and a journey to wholeness is what wraps up the show to tell a story about what happens before wholeness and what happens during and what happens after and it's still an ongoing journey as well and for my part particularly it has a lot to do about a tribute to my sister who i really believe suffered from mental health issues though she was never diagnosed but uh, we, we can sort of safely assume that she suffers from it and the exhibition downstairs is capturing uh, the love that I feel for her and also the confusion that I felt about not being able to help her and, and being aware a little bit too late. My name's Rachel and I work as an art therapist in Bangkok, Thailand. I think uh, one major takeaway is I want people to feel alive again. I think that's one particular aspect of my artwork that when I am doing it or I'm feeling really anxious or my depression is coming and setting on again because I am exhausted or I'm going through something or I've had a really heavy case or a client. Um, most of my artwork is really vibrant and colorful and I, I want people to take that piece with them and that energy and that jubilance and vibrancy. So my name is Nalini Diosara Lovisus and I am a scribe, I'm a painter and I'm a conduit meaning I channel, I act as a medium. Art to me is a medicine because it, it, it opens the door to freedom of expression, a tool, a medium for me to, to, to allow me to present who I am authentically to the world without any labels, without any condition, without any words really, because pictures just speaks for itself and pictures speaks a thousand words. Art is not just art. Art is not just a part-time job. Art is not just a hobby. Art is a medicine, art is spirit, art is, is who we are, freedom. Uh, my name is Jesse Nomind, I'm a live digital painter and artist. Um, I perform live digital painting through a tablet being projected uh, through a computer, um, kind of like digital murals uh, all over the world. And uh, I'm here because I want to help spread awareness to mental health in Thailand and uh, all over the world. I've done a lot of uh, self-development, self-work, and I think that what I found is no matter who you are or where you're at in the world or how much money you have or what level of this game that we're playing, um, everyone's got something. There's definitely some trauma that happened to all of us at some point in time in our lives that if we don't tend to that, it will come out in other ways through relationships or patterns of self-destruction. So I think it's important to know that you're not alone no matter what it is. And um, you know, you have friends and family you can always reach out to if you need to speak with somebody. Um, and you know, whether it's through art or therapy or dance or you know, any sort of expression to have an outlet to uh, get that out, I think is the most healthiest form of uh, tending to that, to that light in us.